And here we have 3728 William Scarborough. A beautiful home just off of 3009. It's a two story with should be just about all sides brick. It might be four sides brick. We'll double check once we get in the backyard. And we have some beautiful mature trees that are dotting the property. We have a couple of them here up front and very many more in the back, which is gonna make it a very nice, very well shaded backyard for people to enjoy. A couple things that are really nice that we can see from the front is we have uh, solar screens throughout the home. It's going to be reducing the electricity bills. It makes it a little bit darker on the inside, but it's a very good trade-off for the amount of money that you save. And we have a great big two-car garage. The home itself is immaculate and incredibly beautiful on the inside. When we come in, we see we have a really nice grayscale paint. It actually looks like a real soft blue, which looks really nice. Some upgraded ceiling fans. And even though it looks like hardwood, tile throughout the entire downstairs. Very nice and incredibly durable. All the carpet we have are on the stairs themselves, and I believe it goes to a laminate upstairs, but we'll see in just a moment. As we come into the home, we see we have our very large formal living room and formal dining, which they are using as an office right now. And beautiful windows that let in a lot of natural light. kitchen itself is absolutely stunning. We have a large breakfast nook, which we can see they have a very good sized table in here freeing up the dining room for any other use. Just a gorgeous kitchen with beautiful upgraded cabinets. I really love the ones with the uh, dishes above the sink there. The backsplash is really nice. And the appliances are fantastic. The island is very functional, it's a very good size. And to go along with such a large kitchen, we have a really nice walk in pantry. We're here, we have a lot of shelves that are going throughout. See where they used to have shelves that would go all the way across this wall, but they took out the space to be able to put in a little uh, chest freezer and plenty of hookups for a washer and dryer. Something very interesting, too. I think they have a laundry chute on this one. We'll have to take a look. Our two car garage is a good size. Uh, they use it primarily for storage, so there's not really a whole, whole lot to see in here. But it's completely finished. See where we have sheetrock throughout the entire garage. It's already taped. It just needs maybe a little bit of texture or just a finishing coat of paint, which looks really nice. Our living room's fantastic. Our kitchen is absolutely gorgeous. The best part about this entire property is its backyard. The sun sets towards the front of the home. So the home itself is shading the back porch. If that wasn't enough, we have a handful of great big trees, which makes this area feel nice and forested. The back deck is amazing. They did a really good job back here. Some nice outdoor eating areas. That's nice. One of the bonuses of this particular location is that we have a great big eight to nine foot concrete wall in the back to give us a lot of privacy from the back. So it's beautiful. Here you can see where we have a fairly large play structure and in comparison the wall just makes it look small, so it's pretty nice.
To the right, we have our powder room. Here we go. Nice granite that matches the kitchen. And then you can see the slope. This is uh, the builders making really good use of their stairwell here. Now, like I had mentioned, on this one, all of our bedrooms are up. We have a nice laminate going through. We'll start in the master bedroom. This particular floor plan is really popular just with the size of the master bedroom itself. We can see they have a king size bed here and plenty of furniture, but it still gives a nice open feel. Our master bath has his and her closets, as well as his and her sinks. Here, we have a combination tub and shower, but it is a great big garden tub. closets are a really good size so it's really nice on this one and here we can see the difference by uh, when I had mentioned we have his and her sinks and countertops nice and deep linen closet and water closet Here we have our HVAC system. This is our air handler. In the first of our secondary bedrooms. See, we have a great big closet. Wow, a phenomenal walk-in closet in the first bedroom. Second bedroom, third, and finally, the shared bath. I like the two-tone thing they did with the paint. 